Hi guys, welcome back. So in this episode, I will teach you how to convert all the picture you find from internet and convert it into white color so you can make an icon on your own. So I just drag a, a picture of a temperature I found on internet. So this is a black color which uh, can work fine, but how can you change it to white? You can see that all the color change they don't have the white and even here it's like gray but, but not uh, completely white so to change to white you click into picture format click into the last tab and move the contrast down all to the negative 100 percent and from there when you go to color you can choose uh, and change it to completely white so again the next example you can see that i have a flask uh, also in black color so I resize it to the same size and then you can see I click in picture format and go to format pen and then I move it to the last tab and from here I move the contrast all the way down and when I click into color and I change it it will change to completely white so the white is a very neutral color I can use it for many uh, design to make my own uh, icon for example and personally I think that using icon is a very great way to make your presentation look very professional very clean and minimalistic and convert all the picture from internet to white is the first step to make an icon so the next step I will show you how to create the icon on your own so after the first step we have all the white uh, icon here so uh, very simple you can choose a circle and draw a circle by holding shift and uh, expanding it and right click to uh, send it to back and you see you can have uh, the uh, logo and also uh, the circle around it and uh, uh, I will group uh, this uh, circle and the icon together and then I will resize it down and just like that I will add the circle uh, to the rest of the icon so I will fast forward here and you can see that I can make all the icon in the center of the circle very quickly And from here I will align all the circle by choosing all choose arrange and align middle and align I choose distribute horizontally so you do distribute horizontally so I will change the background to white which is my favorite and uh, in the next step I will show you how you can uh, spice it up a little bit to uh, add uh, another depth to your account uh, to your icon uh, by clicking uh, in the uh, circle you can choose a gradient field and from here you can choose uh, the color so basically I will choose a radio and choose direction to be center and I will choose the, the two shades of the same color I will choose the lightest shades and I will choose the uh, standard uh, shades over here and I'll adjust a bit uh, to taste and I can copy the gradient format by using the format pane tool and uh, now I can change a different color uh, just uh, be creative with the color uh, you want and if you need more help on color just watch my lesson on uh, color theory so uh, I will fast forward here uh, why I changed the color of uh, all the icon just uh, ungroup the uh, circle with the icon and then you can change the uh, color of the circle so this is uh, also one of the uh, nature or uh, science uh, uh, style of making the uh, radio gradient you can see that a lot uh, in their uh, in their drawing illustration and another way to spice it up the design is uh, create uh, shading you can see a lot in the flat icon design now they have a circle and they have a two shades of the same uh, circle so from here uh, when you click in shapes just choose this uh, half uh, circle 
and uh, move it uh, to be aligned with uh, the circle in the back hold shift to align and then you move it halfway so you can create a half circle uh, hold shift when you uh, rotate it and now it's like 90 degree uh, I will turn off the line and then uh, in the field I will choose uh, the darker color and then I move up the transparency around 50% and voila you can see that very quickly you can create a flat icon from just a picture from internet and now it looks uh, like your own icon and you can have the file so you don't uh, scare of the copyright issue and from here uh, you can uh, save each of these uh, icon into the picture so you can use uh, in any of our future presentation so uh, thank you very much for watching and see you in the next lecture